This is not how you play hide and seek. You're supposed to stay hidden till I come looking for you. Uh, short memory. Yes, short memory loss. And <laughs> Psst, I got him. He's right here. He's trying to hide, but uh, it's not a very good hiding spot. <laughs> Let's go get him. Oh, Le Guerrier des Routes. You're so awesome. I love my... Oh, hey, what's going on? Welcome back to Unturned here in France. So, uh, yeah, I got, um, I got the official name for Road Warrior here. Since we're in France, I did ask for the French words for Road Warrior. And it turns out that uh, it is Le Guerrier des Routes. But I don't think that's how you say it. I think it's more like Le Guerrier des Routes. Or something like that. But I'm, I'm just going to stick with Road Warrior. Yeah, because that's, that's easier for me. I'm just one of them dumb Americans. So thanks. I did ask. So it's my fault for asking. And uh, you guys came through as usual. Thank you very much. And now it's time to go. So let's pluck some corn. Oh, dang it. I didn't want to pluck that corn yet. Oh, shucks. I wanted to put a little bit of uh, experience into agriculture to try to get some extra corn. And did it work? Nope. Still didn't work anyway. All right. Well, let's eat it. Let's eat it. We got to eat. And let's, uh, let's pack up and roll out. So in the last episode, we were over in this... Um, we went to that island right there, which turns out to be a safe house, right? And I got a whole bunch of quests here. So I talked to all the folks over there. I don't know if I recorded all of it, but we'll go through these quests one at a time and uh, try to complete them and then head back there eventually. Um, I don't know where these places are because we don't have a map, so I don't even know where to look. <laughs> We're lost in France, so until we find a chart, it's going to be really difficult to complete those quests. All right, so let's go. Road Warrior is ready to rock and roll. Pepe Le Pew, I should say. And I don't know where we're going. I have no idea. We're just going to go back to the road. I mean, this is where we spawn right here. Right in this little town. Oh, oh, there's drugs. I got to grab those drugs and antibiotics. I could use them right now. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Here we go. We're in it again. All the French huggers. Are oh, oh, gosh. You got me. Oh, my gosh. Look at all these guys. Okay. Okay. Is that how it's going to be? We're trying to leave town. We want to leave. I thought you didn't like Taurus. We're leaving. Leaving. Oh, watch out for the Eiffel Tower. Okay, that's good experience at least. Although I did take a swipe. All that for one bottle of medication. This is really all I wanted. Just happen to see it. Antibiotics, we're at 72%. Let's just check the tent. Oh, hi, Doc. Hi. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Ooh, fast guy. Take that splint too. And that. And any more drugs. Oh, yeah, there we go. Putrefication tablets. We can use that for water. Or putrefy our bud day. But we'll just hold on to it for now. We don't need it. We're not in any danger of uh, getting sick at the moment. All right, let's go. Let's go somewhere new. Let's take a right. Right sounds good. Goodbye, Eiffel Tower. It's great to see you. What an amazing uh, piece of architecture. Oh, another Eiffel Tower. Wow, two. Right here. Oh, three. Wow, I didn't know they had more than one Eiffel Tower. That's amazing. Really, really cool. Those French are really working hard. Around. Oh, what the heck? Ooh, police car. All right, well, this is clearly a dead end. <laughs> but this is nice. I love me a police car. Although, we have road warriors. So I think we're okay. Hi, buddy. This is a cop. French cop. And, oh, French cops in their cuffs. What's up with that? I don't need cuffs. I'd like some ammunition. That'd be pretty awesome. Anybody got a box of ammo? <laughs> Thanks. That was very kind of that French officer to help out a, a lost terrorist. We got a couple of Cobras here, too. Sweet. And, huh, oh my, I can't even jump up there. This is silliness. We really need to work on our jumping ability. Pretty much all of our abilities. We're so, we're just a raw noob. Ow! Holy cow, the dude got me. You little, ow! What the heck, dude? How did he get us up there? I thought we were safe. All right, well, we'll apply this uh, splint. I'll heal up a little bit. All right, hold on. I'm going to salvage all these guns. We already have plenty of Cobras. Just don't salvage my good one. All right, so hold on a sec. Let's bump up our healing. Uh, yeah, let's bump up the healing a little bit. We need to save up for engineering two to repair our new gun, that rifle here. The uh, rattlesnake submachine gun. 
but I also want to put some points in maybe more speed and cooking. We're going to need to cook. Cook is Cooking is very important. All right, that's good enough for now. Let's go ahead and heal up with this little bandage. Should bring us up to, oh, almost 100. Almost 100. Oh, 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 here he comes. This place is loaded with the cops. Loaded, I tell you. What else we got? Another cobra. All right, let's climb up the tower. See what we can see. We really need a map. Ammo's good. All right, let's pull the mag out of our rattler. And we will fill up that mag. And then we'll fill up that mag. So, yeah, we should have a full magazine. We only have one rattler mag, unfortunately, right? We're going to have to find more. So it holds 25 rounds, just like the Viper. But it is suppressed, which is fantastic. Let's go ahead and fix that up. I'm going to take that engineering. Since uh, we are a worker, we get cheaper engineering upgrades to that skill, right? So there we go. And now we can repair this weapon, which is going to be a primary weapon for us, no doubt, because it uses civilian ammo and it's suppressed. And that is amazing. Um, I'm wondering if I can put the kill count on it. It's a, uh, it's a special French weapon, so I'm not sure if that's possible. I don't know if you can put those kill counters on custom guns. I'm going to try to find that out. Let me know if you know the answer to that, and I'll check it off. Uh, check it out on my own off camera and try to do that. And we can start working on a kill count here in France with our Rattler. What is that? Did I just see something? I thought I saw something moving. Did I? No. Okay. <sighs> just a trick of the imagination, that's all. <laughs> Seeing the things after all these days fighting zombies in the zombie apocalypse. All right, let me get organized, eyes, and then we're going to go. Just got a whole bunch of stuff here I'm going to drop off. All right, that's it. We're done here. What should we do with this car? Well, let's take the gas out at the very least. We might as well siphon it. And then I'm thinking maybe just, uh, well, we'll leave it because I might want to come back for this cop car. We could blow it up and try to make space for another vehicle, like maybe a Frenchy vehicle, but I don't know. Let's just leave it for now. We know it's here. We can always come back for it if we want a cop car for some reason. But uh, yeah, we got to go find some food and water, especially. Down to 30% hydration right now. And we need to find some, maybe like a canteen. I guess I can make a canteen. But then we need a well. Right? All that fun stuff. Let's take a right here. Yeah, let's take a right here and see what's down the road. Oh, hold up. Got a stop sign here. Facing the other direction. So we don't technically need to stop. But I don't really know all the laws in France, so we should probably... I think that says stop. Does it say stop in English? Oh, it does. Okay. <laughs> so now I have no excuse for ignoring it. Um, we got a dirt track here. Yeah. Oh, there's some kind of a... Yeah, this is power lines here. You know what? You know what? No, let's stick. Let's stick to the main road. Let's stay on the paved road. I have a feeling the paved road is going to lead us to something more magnificent here in France. Maybe a big city. I am hoping anyway. Um, what we really need is a map so we can see where the heck we're going and then we can maybe work on some of these quests because I have no idea where they lead. <laughs> they tell me where to go. I just don't know where those locations are. Holy smokes. How big is France anyway? Oh, we got a camp. Oh, a camp is fantastic. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy does it. Pepe Le Pew. All right, right here. Let's, uh, let's go in. Let's just go shooty shooty. We might as well. I think we're going to have um, plenty of ammo. Oh, gosh, I was moving before I uh, pulled the trigger. Aim and pull. Aim and squeeze, really. That's a way to do it. Hi! Oh, <laughs> that was close. Uh, we got a paddle here, a lovely paddle. And I don't think we need a paddle for anything, so we're going to break that down. What we need is a map. Anybody have a map? Oh, crossbow and wheat. Eh, not so great. Yeah, I was saying we're going to be able to find... Um, Probably going to be able to get a lot of ammo in this. We're playing normal mode. So I want to do a lot of shooting. Because that's fun. And I like this new weapon. And it is suppressed. So we might as well take advantage of it. It's nice and quiet. Eh, once in a while we might as well stab somebody if it's easy. Oh, oh gosh. Wow, he heard me. Ooh. Oh, thanks. Chart. Thank you, buddy. That was worth every bite. <laughs> now we know where we are. Wow, that is a colorful chart. Super colorful. Hey, it's just like the French. They love their arts, right? Where are we? Oh, way down here, down in the south. Camp 
Ariege. Of course, that's what it is. So, where were we before? Okay, here's the uh, safe zone. And we must have been at this town right here. Biarritz, right? Came down this road. So that's a vineyard up that dirt road, looks like. And here's the checkpoint off the map. And all right, fantastic. So here's Paris way up there to the north. Wow, that's far. And now we can figure out where all these places are, like Cully International Airport. Lost Signal is the lighthouse east of Tulu. Tulu. There's Tulu right here, so the lighthouse must be over here somewhere. Yeah, Marseille. It looks like maybe a dead zone. Dead zone here too is my guess. I don't know. Very, very exciting that we have a map now. And we got a, a well here. Just need a canteen, which we can make with some duke tape. And we got plenty of duke tape on uh, Road Warrior. Pepe. Pepe Le Pew. And uh, there's some trees around here. We can make a... Is there a pine tree? Yeah, pine tree over there. We can make a nice pine bottle. Unless we can find a canteen here. Oh, sleeping bag. That's nice. Very nice. French sleeping bag. I bet it's super comfortable. And yeah, we're going to shoot this guy. These guys are tricksy, so... Not taking any more chances getting up close. Nothing. This uh, little crawler guy I can take care of, though. Whoop. This knife has such short range. Um, let's try the pocket knife. I think that might be better. Yeah, there we go. Stab action. I like the stab rather than the swipe. A lot of paddles around here. These guys must have been canoeing something nearby. Saw. I don't see an axe, oddly enough. I need a camp axe. Chop down a tree. What do we got here? Oh, scuba pants? Yeah, wetsuit bottom. <laughs> and check all the luggage. Hawkhound magazine, but no Hawkhound. Hi, buddy. Got a camp axe on you? No, that's a fishing top. I guess he didn't understand I was speaking English. We're going to have to work on our translations. We, we really need one of those books. You know, those, uh, those travel guys that have... Oh, there's a camp axe. Nice. Thanks! Picnic table? Picnic table knew what I wanted. Yeah, travel guide with all the uh, all the words. The most important words, like... Uh, thank you! Isn't that mercy? Mercy? Let's get organized. I want to pull some water out of there. We're going to need it right quick. But I got to make a bottle, and I got to make it fast. So, let me go dump some of this stuff out. And we'll go chop down a pine tree right over there. Oh, we can scrap the hockey stick now that we have an axe. <laughs> can chop a tree down properly. <laughs> let's put the crossbow in there. That'll save a whole bunch of space. And all right, let's go do it. We got to hustle. Got to make this pine bottle. Got to get some water in the system. All right, let's chop at a tree. Timber. Oh, we need to learn the French word for timber, too. Because that's very dangerous. If there's somebody around here, uh, we don't want to squish them with a tree because they don't understand the word timber. Right? I want to be a responsible tourist. All right, let's make our pine bottle. I don't have my duct tape on me, do, do we? Uh, oh, there's a lot, all kinds of pine stuff, right? We need to be a little more specific. Pine bottle. We need crafting one. We have that. And one duct tape. And we need two more planks. Should not be a problem. Bam. Um, I might chop down more pine later to make pine crates, but the priority right now is to um, get this pine bottle made up. Oh no! Look who's back. All the campers are back. <laughs> All the French lumberjacks have returned. Drat. I had a feeling that was going to happen once we stepped away. Pine bottle! Alright. I'm glad the uh, menu system is still in English. That I can understand. Alright, let's just drop that. And one bottle. Okay, let's go. We're going to have to shoot these dudes again. I just want your water. Excuse me. Oop, that guy just came back from a paddle. Oh, boy. Uh, let's see if we can sneak in here and stab. Wow! Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Man, they turn around quick around here. Don't they? Um, fellas? Just want your water. That's all. Short range with this knife, too. Oh. Hey. Beep, bop, beep. Fishing hat. That's nice. All right. Let's grab the water. Now, this water is not going to be very tasty. It's probably going to make us sick. But we have antibiotics. And we have putrefication tablets. 
Let's, uh, I'm not sure if it's worth even putrefying it, so it's a small amount of water. All right, let's putrefy it. That'll give us nice fresh water. That one didn't hurt much. And we have the antibiotics with us. It's a good thing we found those antibiotics. Glad we stopped for them. And we're just going to fill up. And now we are toxic, but that's okay. This should remedy that. Ah, just enough. Just enough, and I'll grab some more just to have with us. And oh, there's a lettuce in there. <laughs> Someone put a lettuce in there in the in the well. I hope it wasn't somebody's wish. Wait, do French people put lettuce, or vegetables in uh, in in wells to make a wish? That's weird. Hmm. All right, but I won't judge. Whatever. I've never tried it. Maybe it's awesome. Don't knock it till you try it, right? Let's go ahead and eat that lettuce. Actually, we need some chow. I haven't seen any wild animals around, have you guys? I hope there's some wild animals around here. We can do some hunting. In fact, that French chef in the safe zone buys meat. And he pays a very good penny for it. Real good penny. All right, uh, let me get organized yet again. And then we're going to be on our way. The sun is already going down. We haven't really accomplished much. I want to get down the road here. What's down the road? We have Pont du Gard. Over here, I don't know what that is. We have Bernard's Pond. Yeah, we'll just go down the road and see what's there. So yeah, give me a moment, and uh, we'll we'll hop in Pepe and roll down the street. So hold tight, be right back. Ah, uh, nope, it's not working. It's not working. My mouth's not. It doesn't open. Look, see, it's closed, shut forever. <laughs> All right, let's go. We are done here. I'm somewhat organized. And we're just gonna roll down the road. Roll down the road, and we'll see what we can find. Uh, let's bring up that map. How about we take a left? And how about Point du Gard? It's right there, right down the road. Let's go see what's over there. That sounds very French, and maybe it's something spectacular. I don't know, I wanna find some spectacular stuff. Never been to France. So we are gonna use this opportunity to be somewhat of a tourist and see France for the first time. Uh, there's our stop sign. Are we supposed to turn right here? A little bit of a dirt path. Yes, kind of, sort of. Oh, I see a windmill up ahead. A grist mill or whatever it is. Yeah, is this some kind of a farm? Um, I see the French flag flying proudly. All right, let's kill the lights. Uh, I don't see anybody around. Very quiet here. Hmm. All right, let's get the rattler out. Oh, there's a water tower. Oh, I see a French animal. I see a wild animal, although I think it's domesticated. I think it's a sheep. <laughs> our first wild French animal. Well, not wild. Our first French animal, and it is uh, domesticated. Uh, hold on. Let's get the flashlight out. The other thing we need is a, um, the thing that goes on your head. A headlamp, right. Red flower seed. Oh, good. We can make a red flower and put it in Road Warrior to make it all homey and cozy. So this is some, some kind of a farm, which makes sense. We got the mill back here. Uh, we got a water tower, which is going to have dirty water, unfortunately. All these water sources are dirty. We have to putrefy the water, of course. Uh, the rain just stopped, and the moon popped up, and now we have a full moon. Again. We had a full moon last night, and a full moon the first night, too. What's going on with the full moons here in France? It's very romantic. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe France has full moons every single night. It's very, Yes, it's very romantic, isn't it? Where are you going? No, I'm not talking to you. I mean, I don't mean romance between you and I, because we are obviously not compatible. We're very different, you and I. However, um, you look tasty. So here's what we're going to do. You stay right there. And, whoop, hey, get back here. Get back here. I'm glad the, uh, the sheep didn't go all feral on us like the zombies do. <laughs> all right, this should hurt me more than it hurts you, little fella. Oh, you got a friend over there. All right, well, sorry, but I need what you got. And that would be raw mutton, which is tasty. Let's go get the other guy, too. Got to hustle before he gets away. Tells all his friends. Um, where'd he go? Oh, he's hiding. We're gonna play hide and seek? Is that it? It's gonna lead us right to the zombies. I guarantee it. There he is. 
This is not how you play hide and seek. You're supposed to stay hidden till I come looking for you. Uh, short memory. Yes, short memory loss. And oh, ow! Oh, wow! There he goes hiding. Yeah, see that's how you do it. You run and hide, and then I come looking for you. I know you're in here. Glad there's no zombies around. It seems like it's cheating climbing up on this hay. <laughs> oh, there he is trying to get out the other side. Found you. Hey, what you got? Raw mutton. Mm mm mm. We are gonna eat hearty tonight. Fantastic. Now I'm wondering maybe if I should take another sip of water, but that water is not gonna be good. We don't have any way to putrefy it, and we'll, it'll probably make us sick. If we go beneath 50-ish percent, then uh, we will be in trouble. Get a lot of seeds here. That's good. We gotta get a base. We gotta set up a base, and we can get some food growing. Um. But I'm not sure exactly where that's going to be. I'd like to look around France first for a little while. Try to find a nice spot. I mean, we just got here. So there is no rush. Point de Garde is right there. Should we go? Yeah, I thought maybe this was it. But it's still a little bit ways on. It is dark, though. And it's hard to see without a headlamp. Uh, tell you what. Is there a... Let's go chop down a tree. Make a fire. We'll cook up some mutton. Oh, there's a tree right there. Where's my axe? Yeah, let me grab my axe. I don't have a campfire, so we want to make a nice campfire. And we'll have some mutton dinner tonight. Alright, there we go. I got plenty of wood to make that campfire. Awesome. Okay, we have our campfire. Let's, uh, let's go sit her down. I'm going to grab this wood because we're going to make some crates tonight. I don't think we're going to get to Pointe du Gard. Today, we're gonna have to wait till tomorrow. We're gonna spend the night right here. We got a nice shelter in here, too. Yeah, we'll put the we'll put the bedroll down. In fact, let's grab that bedroll right now. We got the blue one in honor of Papa Smurf. I'm gonna put it right over here. We like to sleep under the stars and a full moon. It's beautiful. I don't wanna sleep indoors. Get a fire going, and we should have skill to make. Some mutton. Oh, yeah, we do. Cooked mutton. We know how to grill it. That's about it. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, hold on. Did you see that recipe right there? Mutton stew. If we had a carrot, a potato, a tomato, um, a leek, and a frying pan, we could make some mutton stew. All right, well, we're going to remember that for next time. But for now, oh, a little French mutton down the hatch. It was delicious. Now you see it, now you don't. That's how you play hide and seek with the sheep. <laughs> In case you were wondering. Alright, yeah. Let's call it quits here for now. What the heck are these things coming in? Raptors! We got raptors incoming! Holy smokes, that was scary, freakyish. Oh my gosh. The, the, the turkeys. Friendly? Hi. Uh, what's the French word for friends? Oh, there he goes. There they go. Oh, I think we, we gotta run them down. They're so fast. I mean, I guess we can shoot them, but I can't even see them. All right, we're gonna run them down. I'm gonna get some French turkey. Let's go get some French turkey with the road warrior. That would be very appropriate. All right, road warrior is French here. Pepe Le Pew. I'm gonna run down some turkeys. Oh, they're, look at them go. Very quick, but not quick enough. <laughs> there goes one turkey. Roadkill. Our first French roadkill. That was the other one. Oh, there's more berries here, too. These are good, these are good ones as well. Yes, the uh, mauve. Mauve. We'll grab those up and let's see what that guy dropped. Well, dropped his body. Popped him right out of his skin. <laughs> we just missed Thanksgiving. What a shame. Now, that other guy, he ran fast and far. And where'd he go? Psst, I got him. He's right here. He's trying to hide, but... Uh, not a very good hiding spot. <laughs> Let's go get him. Now, all right, we're going to stab him. And hopefully we can kill him with one shot. Oh, there he goes. Whoa. Oh, man. He's got those big wings. He can't fly very well, though. All right. Well, I can't fly either, so I'm going to chase him down. So, all right. Yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed. Bye. Turkey, come back.